and I'll write your name. Don't say I didn't say I didn't warn ya. Always oh, only one life if that's torture. Don't say I didn't say I didn't warn ya. Oh, it's gonna go down in flames. It's over. It's Good morning. We gotta um coupon placement job and you love the game for walmart my lips look really weird in this light look if i go too close it like gets weird on me do it again i don't know what that means i don't know either looks fine to me good morning Ticket placement job today. Who's excited? Oh. Who said, who's seen the movie It Ends With Us? I've seen it three times in the movie theater. What? I'm looking at the album cover. Thank you. My lips do not match my hair, and that's what's throwing me off. <laughs> no, I'm not even kidding. Thank you, Miss Ohio Vibes. Oh, thank you, Gal Kelly. I was reading her both names at the same time. I didn't. All right, so it's the lip liner that's doing it. Okay. You look exceptional with or without the lip issue apparently. So, um, we're gonna, we got it. we have an I Spy buy and try that I found and we're gonna take inside of Walmart and a coupon job. Thank you guys. So, 5,000 likes gets us in the side of the store, in the side of the store. In, in the side of the store. Inside the store. If we're lucky, we can actually get in the front door. And we're gonna do the coupon placement job and then we're gonna do the, um, the other one, the I Spy. Mm -hmm. Hey, Priscilla. Merchandiser is amazing, Miss Ohio Vibes. We've got some merchandising to do today, so if you want to know more about it or you just want to see people go about it and do it in their regular day, that's what we do here on live. So stick around. We'll be answering questions and all that good stuff. We do this every day, so just drop a follow and feel free to lurk because all our stuff is free. <clears throat> Who's this. Grace? So, 5,000 likes, it gets us going into the store. So let's do that. And we do have two, we always do two or three live goals, just penny gifts, and we give them back to you guys on Instagram. It is a lot more, Cindy. There's so much more that you can do on Survey Merchandiser. Why does my lip look weird? Back here, it looks like there's something on my lip, right? Just not home. Looks like I have like lip gloss on. I think I have some weird filter on. I think there's a weird filter on that I don't know about. Thank you guys. Two thousand likes. We need two and a wait, three thousand more. I did that last time. We did. <laughs> did you? Yeah. I forgot how to math. I'm almost to five thousand in earnings. Oh, Miss Ohio vibes. That's amazing. That's awesome. Bonnie Bilter, I didn't see your question. So bye. Y'all, I'm not the one today, just so we're just so we're all clear. Today is not the day. Oh, good to know. That's gonna skip the song. We'll stop touching it. I can't help it. Yes, the song is perfect. Hold on, it's gonna come back on.
Oh, oh, good. So they've sent all the people in here today that want to test my my gangster. I guess I don't know. Are you okay today? I'm not you okay. You need a safe space. No, no, I don't. Oh, good God! We're at five thousand likes. Or at 5,000 likes. So, hi, my name is Joanna. I teach people how to make money, save money, and get cash back for free from their phones. No course, no book, no affiliate marketing, network marketing, or pyramid schemes. Nothing to buy and nothing to sell. Everything's in my profile. Three pinned videos, a size hustle playlist, and a link to all the apps and websites that I use on a daily basis. Uh, if you can't see the link or can't click it, it's joannalinofficial.com. Um, yeah, no, Sarah, I'm like, I'm like, people are not, people are peopling today, and I am not here for it. So, we're going to go inside and do these couple of jobs. And then we're going to get out here and we're going to answer questions. And if you guys could keep liking, sharing, and giving gifts, if you can, if you can't, likes and shares are where it's at too, guys. Comment. Um, talk to me. Do all the things so that TikTok stops talk getting me. me out of um, freaking uh, shadow ban jail. It's really bad. It's really bad. You ready? No. Yeah. All right, we're going to start with Survey Merchandiser. So I'm going to get it ready. So this is the Survey Merchandiser job. We're going to get $12 for this job. Uh, it asked me if I want to see other... If you were here, you could see other jobs that are in this area. I can't right now because you guys are here with me, which is fine. I love y'all. It's great. So it's going to have getting started. This is the olive oil coupon placement. This is super easy. Oh, it shows these. Ready? Ready? I'm going to show ready. you. We're ready. You just closed it. I know I closed it. Okay. All right. So... So these coupons, we got them. We got them. So it says continue. I have these. So I'm yep. going to take a picture of them. <clears throat> Beautiful. Yep. And just giving us some reminders. Again, we'll be showing you step by step what we're doing. All right, let's go inside. So, uh, if you want to know more about what we do, you know, you're not going to be lost in the dark. These lives are meant to be instructive. So just know. We're gonna go inside of Walmart. We gotta get ourselves on the Wi-Fi. So just give us a second to connect to the Wi-Fi, which means the stream will skip. We're it's us, it's not you. Don't we're doing threat. It'll we're be just fine. Stop! We're doing two jobs today that we don't normally do, so that's pretty cool. Stop! Well, because you kept talking and I was trying to talk. I wasn't even looking. Well, I kept trying to talk, and you were like, Wait. and I would, you would be like, and, 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 and. <laughs> no. I'm busy. Guess the finger. <laughs> I'm busy. I see that. Busy being a grouch. No, I'm not being a grouch. People are this, already in this on This is nerves. not Sesame Street. Get off this street right now. All My right. name's not Oscar, but I am a grouch. Get off this street right now. All My right. name's not Oscar, but I am a grouch. Get off this street right now. My name's not Oscar, but I am a grouch. Oh, I should probably get a carriage because they're probably going to have me put stuff in the carriage. Yeah, that's a good idea. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Yep, she's just going to go grab a carriage. So again, if you guys don't know what merchandising is, it's the act of going inside of stores and we get paid by the job to go check on products and companies. There usually might be some associated retail tax tied to what we do. So in this case, we'll be putting coupons on this uh, brand of olive oil and uh, And I picked the it. worst carriage. Well, you didn't have to pick that carriage. Somebody hit him. You have right. a carriage. Let's see it. Let's see. Um, so it says, okay, why is everybody walking down the right side? All right, yes, so it, we call it a carriage. It is a carriage or a cart. It's not a buggy. I swear if it's a pram, get out. <laughs> so we are there now are no looking prams. for these olive oil sprays. Yeah. They are, and I looked these up. So what does it say? Head to the olive oil. Uh, did we pass it? No. No. It's coming up. No. Probably with salads and vinegars. Most and, likely. Yes, so every project that we do comes this, with instructions. So you don't have any experience. I'm sorry. This is an abomination. Disgusting. Get away from me. This is an abomination. Oreo Coke flavored Zero Coke. Oreo. Not even is it not even regular Coke. It's Coke Zero, which is and, and then it's the Oreo. No, the, it says fizzy. Right. That's fizzy. That's the the cookies have the pop rocks in it. It's fizzy because it's soda. What soda needs to, you to put the fizzy no moniker on there? Everybody knows that soda's fizzy. What's this? Flaming hot. What? Doritos. Thai curry. 
Oh, do you uh, want them? We're getting them? a bag of those on our way out. Oh yeah. God. So again, no. every pick product that we do, I mean, every project what? that we do has instructions. So you just have to be able to read and pay attention to details and stuff like that. We're looking for, nope, there is no olive oil in it's this It's probably aisle. in the... It'll be in the next aisle. It said it was in, oh, hold on. So you know what's great about um, the work? Is that you can do oh. things with their app. What do you need? Nothing, things got moved around. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. Can you fix it later? No, I, I, I actually can't, so deal with it. Okay. That's sort of where I need it to be. So, okay, so we're just going to open up I looked at, So I know the name of the product. I already looked it up. La Tondrelle or Tourangelle. It's in aisle 818. 18, okay. If you guys can't, store, I was going to say baking. Every store is going to be set up a little different too. So where it may be in one location, it may not be in the other. And that's why a lot of these projects need to be repeated because they rely on your input. You're the eyes and ears for these brands so that they can better trust their sales figures and stuff like that. There we go. Extra virgin olive oil spray by La Tourangelle. Please don't La Tourangelle at me. <laughs> La Tourangelle. Oh. Okay. So yes, we found looking them. sprays and things. Continue, I have found the products that we're looking for. Record the product location. Top shelf, aisle 18. 18 Easy enough, top right? Top shelf, baking aisle. Oh yeah, also the baking aisle. I suppose that's true as well. Yep, and then you can take a picture, assess where it is on the shelf, and move on to the next section. We have all of the spray products here. So avocado oil, let's see, let's click on it because it gives you the... Yep. Also, it gives you the UPC so you can actually match the number that's there with what's physically on the barcode itself so that you know. So, so, they, two, eight, it's so it's neither product or tag is on the shelf. Correct. So that one they don't have. Baking spray, have. five ounce. Do they have the blue one? They said they had all of them. Blues. No product and nothing on the... I think this is the only one they have. Yep. Well, it's the, the one that's up there too. Where? So there's this one and then there's this one. Oh yeah. Those so are the this two is that they have here. This is the yellow. It's yellow. Grape seed. Hmm. With virgin avocado. Just check the. Sixteen point nine ounce. Nope. So this is just the sprays. What about the oils? Is there? Look further down that way. Yep. Oh, here we go. Here we okay, go. let's go so back to what I was doing. Seed. Let's try this again. Grape, grape seed, seed so right there. This is the avocado. No, I'm looking for the avocado first. Okay. Avocado right in front of you. Yes. Avocado oil. This in guy stock. Right here. Present in stock. and available. Number of facings is two. If you guys don't know what a facing is, it's just a row of product. So look, one row, two row. That's two facings. Complicated stuff, right? Yes, the price tag is on. See, they switch yep, it. I, I know. I swear they do it. Price always. tag is on the shelf. It is not on sale. Eleven fifty-eight. Usually they oh. don't do that. It was not eleven hundred dollars. Put eleven fifty. Okay. And take a photo of that particular one on the shelf. On to the next one. You do have to go back and fix the, I uh, am. the back photo, but baking we'll get there. spray is the blue. I don't see that one. Oh, that might be in a different spot, too. The baking spray, yeah. That might be with, where's the baking sprays? Like Pam? Yep. Because Pam was back there, and we didn't see that. That one's not there, so it's okay. not there. So that okay, that was correct. Cooking spray. Didn't see that one either, because that was the Pam all back there. Grape seed. That one's up here. Grape seed oil. Okay. Yeah. So the name of this project is what? Olive oil coupon placement audit, something like that. It's a word salad. But this is one of the projects that we do on Survey Merchandiser. There are three merchandising apps that we use, Survey Merchandiser, Field Agent, and Moby. And you can use all of them for free if you go to Joanna's link in her profile and just click the link in the bio. There's nothing to buy or sell. These apps are free to use with or without us. And you can go try these in your everyday lives. and. Uh, Go get some work done, and we get paid by the job to do this. What's that? Extra virgin. I'm looking because they're all over the place. I know, they're kind of spread. I don't really like the way Walmart has these spread out. <clears throat> no, they don't have it. 
they have like every other type of oil, but I don't actually see the olive oil of that brand. Okay. I'll do that after. So we're gonna go to the coupon placement. That's what we're gonna do first. Okay. Extra verge of right. So it's gonna be any of these. So these like these can ones. Yeah. How many two dollar off coupons were you able to place? Well, let's place them first. Oh, is it this down here, hun? There's a big one. I don't know if there's multiple sizes, but that's definitely the same one. You're gonna drive me bananas. Bright and peppery. <laughs> I guess it depends on your uh, situation, Greg. Uh, these projects can take anywhere from, you know, they pay anywhere from five to 25 bucks a piece. Some of them take as few as 30 seconds. Uh, some of the mid-size audits, you know, can take you upwards of 30, 40 minutes, especially when you're brand new. If it's taking longer than, it, than you think it's supposed to, it will get easier. See, it did say all those were here. That's why I'm like... Yeah. But yeah. Um, the better opportunities that show up as well too. So you have the freedom to do this in your spare time. We are not on the clock right now. We don't, we're not tied to a desk or a time clock or anything. We just go show up and do this work wherever we have time. Um, we happen to work full time now, but this is something that works just as well as supplemental or part-time income. So it's never gonna ask for 40 to 60 hours that you don't have. And we encourage you guys to stress test that because a lot of this can just be done with any availability and any schedule. Now we're just gonna hang all these neck tags on the bottles because we were mailed these coupons. So that's what we're gonna do. Do, 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 do. Your sweater is so cute. Thank you. It's game day. It was supposed to be game day. It was day. supposed to be game day. We're gonna go see our nephew play college football. He's really good. He's a freshman who's already starting, yeah. which is pretty crazy. Oh, how do I know which ones go to which? Do you have to take a picture of them in the cart? Nope. I'm just asking. Nope. 12 of the $2 off. Okay, so I need to get, this, these are all the $2 so far. Yep. Okay, that's good. Just wanna make sure I was doing the right thing. Can you hold the $1? Hold. hold. Right. Oh, I'm sorry, oh, let me get okay. out of your way. I just gotta share this piece. So the name of this one is, it, it's usually the names of the job on certain merchandise are a very word salad. It's like olive oil coupon placement and audit project, whatever. Um, but I'll show you what the apps look like and I can probably find this same one again. All right, um, what other ones do they have like that? Uh, so they grape seed. The grape seed they asked for. They didn't ask for any of these, but they carry these as well. And then the uh, the big, the big extra virgin olive oil. Yeah, I'll do those too. Okay. So these coupons, this is actually a shipment required job. So they were actually FedEx to us in a, uh, after a few business days, which just means if your projects require shipping, you just got to uh, wait for those materials to get to you. And then once you have them in hand, you can start your project. But yeah, we, these got requested and approved ahead of time. But this is very simple retail stuff. If you work retail once or twice and you can follow directions and you know problem solve, that's oh, really all it's ever going to ask you for these. It's very uh, light duty stuff. Very rarely are you doing some heavy lifting, but you know, there's some associated inventory and stocking and things of that nature. Oh, did I leave my phone back there? Yes, I did. You probably did. Excuse me. Sorry. I just left my phone over here. Oi. All right. So next is the $1 off. Uh, how many of the $2 off? So everyone's going to be a little bit different, Erin. Um, generally speaking, talking to managers or at least uh, somebody that works at the store is pretty common. Um, not everyone's going to ask for it, though. It also depends on how much uh, you're doing in the store. Like, if you've got to move a lot of product around, you're probably going to need their say-so. For something as simple as, like, dropping some coupons on it, sometimes it will, sometimes it won't. Sometimes it depends on the job, um, like, or the store that you're doing it at. But, uh, yeah, it'll tell you all of the job requirements. And I'll, again, show you these apps after to show you step-by-step -step what you'll be looking at, how you can pick up these projects in your everyday life, and... Uh, how payment work, how taxes work, all that good stuff. And so the dollar off ones go on the spray products and the uh, two dollar off ones go on the big actual oil can thingies. 
and obviously they're different shapes, so hopefully you'll notice, hey, look, this thing's not going on properly, probably because you got it on the wrong one. <clears throat> yes, this is all 1099, so everything that we earn is on the book, is taxable, um, you know, so we pay taxes on everything that we earn. But uh, the cool thing about being 1099 is that you work for yourself. So again, you, most of our followers already have a full-time job and choose to do this you know, in a supplemental or part-time basis, but you can do this full-time. Uh, it really just depends on what you're willing to swing. Good morning, good morning. Yep, so this is the oil, olive oil avocado. Olive oil, it's like, it, it, it means nothing. It's like olive oil audit coupon placement business. So we work with a lot of different food and beverage products. This is just one. Again, we're not a dedicated vendor for any one of the brands that we rep, nor are we employed by the stores that we work in. We are third parties. So we work with a lot of different brands. Uh, not every brand is gonna have the resources These of like a Walmart are horrible, by the way. or like, a, um, you know, any of those things. And so uh, it's a lot of indie products. Uh, it might be some whole food, uh, plant-based stuff. It could be just, you know, basic startup, brand new <clears throat> type of product. But we don't work exclusively with food and beverage. But it does mean that you'll be in a lot of uh, grocery stores near you, also Targets and Walmarts, but, uh, the wholesale clubs if you have memberships. Uh, you can also do work inside of gas stations and hardware stores and pet stores and pharmacies and basically everywhere else that products are sold. So the acquisition of the jobs, it depends on the project. Some of these are designated as claim and go and they're ready for you right now. Some of them require prior authorization or like a specific, you know, not necessarily experience level, but they, they have to approve the project. Um, and some of these do require specific uh, materials like this one. We needed to have the coupons before we did this one. But uh, on the whole, the app lets you accept and decline projects as you please. And um, you can kind of build your day based on what's available near you. And um, again, works. it's very flexible because uh, we work for ourselves. So tracking miles, obviously, you know, because you're an independent contractor, will benefit you for tax time. Oops, uh, sorry, let me get out of here. No, 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 you're fine. That. All right. Merchandise. These are already merchandised. I'm not really. Yep. Well, I can turn them this. All forward. Very nice. Fantastic. I don't know what you just said. <laughs> hey, that lady just took one of my coupons. Yes. Very nice. Uh, so uh, there's no cap on what we make. We get paid by the project. It's hard for us to make uh, straight up income claims though because we're all working different rates in different parts of the country for a different number of jobs, different experience levels, lots of things to factor in. If you want some helpful guidelines, we usually try to treat $24 an hour as a baseline. And that's like the floor. Like it's very hard to go below that. We're usually floating well above that. And the reason we can reach those rates is because we've been doing this for a very long time. Uh, you don't need to be doing this for like 10 years like we have. But um, generally speaking, you will get more comfortable uh, and more confident and be able to do a lot more, the more practice that you have doing this. I need to find somebody else. Excuse me, I got a question oh. for you. Yeah. Do you have one of those scanners? Because I'm doing a merchandising project. I want to see if you guys have the that the Laten gel grapeseed oil um, in the back. Yeah, I have to scan the. Uh, oh yeah, no, no, you're around. fine. So they, they absolutely have the authority to, Kelly, so but by any, and large, any of these especially guys, once they realize what you're there to do, guys. a lot of times you're there helping yeah, them do their yeah. job. Anybody that's worked in retail knows, like, everything's your job. Yeah, if any, if any of these products are in the back. Uh, a lot of us just pop in and do these little these little vendor things, and it's one less product for them to have to worry about. Um, these projects can be used for any number of reasons. Sometimes they're looking for, like, no. a first-hand okay. account. Can I take a picture of that just because they're asked for that? To check on products inside of stores in different Perfect. parts of the country. Sometimes it's kind of like this where you're almost disseminating little information to them or you're getting feedback from them about the product. Uh, in this case, we had prog uh, coupons that we could place on, but you know, I'm gonna let her continue talking. Oh, she's done. I just don't put the workers on the on the camera because they don't consent to do that. Yep, there's all, there's all types of uh, agencies and things that you can do this with uh, salaried or uh, full-time or anything like that, but this is the freelance version of that. It's like if you took vendor work and smashed it together with like DoorDash, essentially. <laughs> All right, so that was additional comments. Yep. Uh, no other, no other no back other. stock. Do you not have your mic on? I have my mic on, why? 
Because they, they said I wished I could have... Oh, okay. I have it on. Okay. Because I thought that you were talking this and I wish they could have heard their conversation. Can you guys not hear? It says it's on and connected. Can you guys okay. hear me? All right. That's fine. But yeah, it was really just a benign interaction. What did you ask him? Because I didn't hear. Just if he could check on uh, any of the Tangel, Latangel products. He looked them up. There was none in the back stock. That was it. Mm -hmm. So that prevents us from having to go in the back room, which, you know, for some stores is a, is a no-go. So again, if you can just flag somebody down, and be, can you just assure me that there's nothing else in the back? They'll hit it with a scanner and you'll be on your way. But it's usually just very basic interactions. You're not selling anybody anything. It's really just a uh, first person account. And these brands can use the projects that, that was you 12 submit. Bucks. Yeah. For, um, to better trust sales figures, to make decisions, to do all the things that happen behind the scenes with retail. All right, so now let's go get that uh... Buy and try. Buy and try. Yeah. Uh, yeah, no, I realized that I was talking at the same time after. And then I shut up, turned around, and she was already done talking. It was quick. Like, those managers, right. my son did one yesterday, and he is not one to want to talk to managers. Yep. And he was like, Mom, that was so easy. Yep. He is, that is just not him. So, all again, right. all these apps, again, you can go try and use these today if you want to. Um, but uh, they are all free. There's nothing to buy or sell. All you have to do all right, is go, go to the profile. Product. Oh, come on now. All you have to do is go to the TikTok profile, which is going to take me a year to do because my phone is just in complete disrepair at this point. Which one did you want, babe? All right, the Thai chili. That one looks good. The orange, yeah, that one. I want to try that. Link in the bio or go to joanneleanofficial.com. This is all the stuff that we use on a daily basis. And you guys can use all these with or without us. They don't cost anything. So the merchandising work is gonna be right here. We just did a, fur a survey merchandiser project. Now we're gonna do a field agent. It's a buy and try. We'll get right to that in a minute. Of course, not everything that we do is work. Sometimes it's just games and surveys, getting some residual cash for spending some time on your phone throughout the day and getting paid out through PayPal or gift cards or something like that. And saving money on everyday purchases, whether it's gas, groceries, restaurant purchases, save the money that you spend things on. So all these resources are free. Go back to the profile when you grab some, watch the pin videos and the side hustle playlist, and then come and say hi, because we go live to answer questions and show you how all these work. All right, work. let's see if I can find them. We're looking so for Olay, to, right? You tell Olay me. melts, yep. yep. I'm gonna look so this. this one is on Field Agent. This one is a buy and try. So again, merchandising B9. is a pretty wide right, umbrella. Right and um, so this is what we're doing. We're looking for this product, and once I find it. Melts. Olay Cleansing Melts. Oh, right here. There it is. Good catch. All right, so it's the blue. Okay. Let me make sure I have it right. Nine ninety. It's nine eighty eight. Nine eighty eight. Um, does it have? I guess it'll depend when we scan it, but. Yes. One straight on photo of the entire shelf. So we're actually gonna purchase this product, get fully reimbursed and get paid on top of that to do it. So again, if you're not interested in doing any product reimbursement or buy and try stuff, you certainly do not have to, but it does fall under the merchandising umbrella and you will see these projects from time to time. A few rules about these, whatever money that you put out for a product reimbursement, you are always 100% reimbursed for as long as you provide the receipt and uh, we'll show you how that works. Um, also, you get paid in addition to doing the project, so it's not just free products. Can we get a Sharpie? Sure. That way. Yep. And um, third, obviously, you get to keep the product for free. The only thing you can't do with the product is return it to the store. But if it's food, you can eat it. Uh, whether it's food or not, you can throw it in the garbage, you can give it to charity. It does not matter what you do with it. Um, you just can't return it to the store. So it's a, it's a face. Face. Melt? Yeah, so it, it gets your makeup. Your face. No, it gets your makeup off. <laughs> melts your face. You have one for Little Caesars, a free pizza plus five bucks. Exactly. So yeah, there's lots today. of fast food places. Yeah. I might that go can live show up on and there. order that and have Vinny oh, go pick yeah. it up. I'd love it. I'd love it. Okay, let me just just not not work related, but let me uh, let me hear your top three fast food pizza places. Let me, let me hear with just top three. Just just list them one to two to three in order. And AJ's gonna Which talk one? so much shit. And I'm shit. gonna talk so much shit. Go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> so if you don't want it, you can do whatever you want with it. You can get rid of it, you can give it to somebody, you can throw it in the trash, it does not matter. I'm getting a sharp because we don't have one in the car right now and I need it. Yeah. Your hair is so cute. Thank you. 
lady. Thank you, I said. Oh, I, I didn't said hear to you. them, you can't hear me. No. I want the, this kind, the pen kind. All right, so I have to make two separate purchases because I got to have the melts on its own. Yeah. We just happen to get a, a, a Sharpie because it helps us with the buy and try section of this, but. If you have one at home, just bring it with you. Did I enjoy? Oh yes, I very much enjoyed our dinner last night. She made the fajol. Did anybody put it, it was, away or no? It was lish. Of course I did. Oh. I put away, you don't leave the fajol out. <laughs> That's true. Okay. So I hate to break it to you guys, but uh, Pizza Hut and Papa John's are buttatum, buttatum tier. No, no I like Pizza Hut. Buttum. I like Pizza Hut. I don't I like Papa John's. I accept Little Caesars. I accept oh, Domino's. Oh. oh, are you kidding me? Pizza Hut is too greasy. No. Pizza Hut is top tier. And Papa John's. Papa John's is too sweet. Is too sweet. I don't like that their pizza. I is don't hate sweet. it as much as him. It's I, not dessert. I feel that Pizza Hut is top tier for takeout pizza, like for, for fast food pizza, fast no food thanks. pizza. Um, top tier, my favorite, always will be. You can't tell me different. There's the nostalgia factor. There's the deliciousness factor. There's the gooey extra cheese factor. No, no. Yes. Listen, oh. I think that people just like Papa John's because of the garlic sauce, not because of their pizza. And Pizza Hut, of all the pizzas that I've had, chain or otherwise, three bites that, instant heartburn for me. Instant it's all, heartburn. You get instant heartburn from no, looking I don't. at things. Yes. No, I don't. Yes, you do. I've been a good boy. No, you have not. Yes, I have. All right, I can put my phone away right now. Yep. So we do have a couple of purchases that we're making for the buy and try. Just know you should keep your product um, on a separate transaction. So I'm buying the chips that I want to try, and then we're getting that uh, Sharpie. Are these all closed? Jesus. Oh, perfect. Thank you. And then we'll go back to the car and then we'll show you the last few steps of it. Most of the time, the buy and try stuff, they are reimbursing you in exchange for your honest review. Usually you will post the review on like a target.com or maybe it's the actual website. In this case, it might be olay.com. Not sure yet. Haven't gotten that far in the project. But, um, you know, just go and give it a fair shake. Try it. That's, that's what the point of it uh -oh. is. Now Most I of the do time, three purchases. What, look, whose fault is that? I'm an idiot. <laughs> um, more often than not, uh, they will actually have yeah. you put in writing that um, I received reimbursement for my big exchange for my honest review. Just do that. Um, one thing to know too: always screenshot your review before you submit it, because usually all of these reviews go through like an internal. Uh, screening thing to make sure that nothing inappropriate got put in them. So uh, you need to have the screenshot of the job, of, of the review that you sent before you actually uh, submit it because it doesn't show up immediately and you have to scour the net to wait for it to show up. Hold that for that. This is the Olay one? Yes, it is. OL Melts. So we just take this puppy and we go to the register, I mean to the car. Obviously, we can't try it yet because you're supposed to do it in your, when you have makeup on, and in your house. A lot of times they want photos of you actually opening the product and stuff like that. But by and large, there's no reason to not give it a review, especially when it, you're right. getting it for free. You know what give, I mean? Give me the receipt for that. There you go. You take your chips. There you go. And I'll put these away. Okay. So this is just a buy and try for me. I'm not getting paid for this. It's just a try. Well, no, it's a buy and a try, but there's no reimbursement. Dang. Nobody asked you to do it. Nobody asked me to do this except me. Oops. Putting the carriage back. I don't even know what Blaze Pizza is. Is that something regional? Because we don't have that. What? Blaze Pizza. All right, hold on. Getting off Blaze Pizza is that something regional? Because we don't have that. What? Blaze Pizza. All right, hold on. Getting off this pizza is that something regional? Because we don't have that. What? Yes. Yeah, so any referral codes that we have for you guys are going to be written in the profile um, when you click the link in the bio. Uh, any applicable referral codes will be written on the link to the app itself. 
If there isn't one written, it either doesn't have a link or the referral is embedded in the link itself and you don't need to enter it manually. Well, listen, I can only talk about pizza chains so much because y'all, oh. we live in Connecticut. We live in Connecticut and we have the best pizza in the world. Look it up. Well, not <sighs> the world, the United States. Mm. So I'm going to upload pretty, all those to it's Fetch it's and pretty, stuff too. It's pretty renowned. And that's not just me, you know, everybody says so. We're be we beat New York. What is wrong with my, what is this? Is there a filter on? I think that, I told you, I think there's a filter on. What the hell is this? Did I, where's my phone? Right here. Oh God. Yeah, look it, I look stupid. That's why I looked dumb earlier. Oh. Would you like some lashes on your lashes? Oh, let's, let's take off this. How do you fix? I can't. You can't fix it? I can't fix it. Um, I, it's not that. It? Okay, well, we're going to look pretty today, guys. Enhance. All right, Enhance. so stop it. Stop it. I'm turning things off. Oh, Let's yeah, turn that on. off. Yep, yeah, stop. There we go. Okay. Much better. Look like a person now. So this is the receipt. Yeah, I could use the, I could use the melt. Oh, my God. So we got the receipt. It's asking for the receipt. Got the receipt. You got the receipt? Take a photo of the receipt. Yep. It's going to ask how much I spent. Sinopi's Pizza. All right, I'll be looking. We're not far. Down here we got Sally's and we got, uh, what's the other big one? Oh, Pe uh, Pepe's. Frank Pepe's. All right, now I got to take a, show the barcode line marked out. On the product. On the product. So, so that's that, why we so have the Sharpie. taken at home, but... Just put it in your lap. How are they going to know? All Just right. don't get a picture of your car in it. Oh, I thought these were bigger. Oh, well. Well, they're not. Still works. Oh, they're pens? Yeah, I like those. One, I think one of them is supposed to be thick. I think I just got the wrong one. It's fine. Probably. Opened product. Yep. So now she's going to grab her stuff. Listen, Fatima, I, I have had plenty of pizza in New York City, and it's not me. It's all these published articles. Connecticut, everybody comes from the city to Connecticut and brings all the good New York-style pizza. Except for we have so the better you know, water. Just That's so what it know. is. Yes, it has do to do with water. water. Yes, the water content. <clears throat> Hold on, I'm trying to take a proper picture of this. Okay. Taking a photo. Sure. And obviously, you know... Try the product. Do what it's for. I actually have used these before. You wet them, they get bigger, and then they just they uh, distribute product all over your face. It's pretty awesome. Like, there's the little steps. Mm -hmm. Okay? So I'm going to write my little review. Mm -hmm. So this one is Field Agent. So Field Agent has some of the merchandising stuff on it, but it does have some of this product review. Um but yeah, Jennifer, so we do this live uh, once a day, if not twice a day. We're freelance merchandisers, and we show you guys the apps that we use every day to make money, save money, and get cash back. They are all for free in the profile. There's nothing to buy or sell. You're not hawking products to friends, family, and strangers. You're not doing letters. You're not on social media. You're not recruiting people. This is just independent contract work for anybody that feels like they can go answer some questions about products inside of stores. Um, you know, give some pictures and some data and some inventory and upload projects by the job. Um, it's really simple. You can start off with no experience and you can just go work independently, get more confident, take on more work, and we'll show you what those apps look like in a minute. Many of these do work in Canada as well, for sure. Yep, for sure. But it's just independent contract work. Uh, nothing's going to be international though. Uh, mostly it's going to be US and Canada. There's some availability in some select countries otherwise, but uh, we're still looking for international opportunities and stuff. Water audit sampling on merchandiser. Yeah. Uh, the, the sampling? I don't know if I've done the sampling. I've definitely, we've definitely done the water restocks for sure. Yes, that's true. So again, a lot well of done. times when you are using multiple uh, 
apps together, they're going to start to blend together. So for this one, we got free product for that. And so now Joanna bucks. can take the receipts that she used and just take pictures of those receipts and upload them to Fetch, which just gives you credit on any receipt that you generate. Um, there's also promotional offers that are on that app where we'll give you uh, bonus points for doing so. But all the receipt apps, there's a ton of them out there. We have Fetch here. We have Pogo here. Uh, Inbox Dollars and Swag Bucks also have receipt programs. Ibotta helps you do that. Um, Upside helps you do that. A lot of points. these you can upload multiple times. Uh, so well, we got another receipt. We got another. That was from today. I'm another. Gonna, I'm just going to upload them all. Fuck it. <laughs> yep. There's an, that's another one. Uh, there's, there's a ton of them. There's a ton of them. <clears throat> but we have a few of them in the profile. Yeah, if we can get our hands on one in a decent place that has decent service, Cindy, yeah. what? it's just we're a little bit limited to what we can show you guys live because we need to either have the Wi-Fi to do it or the data signal. Um, we live in Connecticut and there's a ton of dead spots out here, like just inexplicably. I, we fight with it every day, like with every single day. A lot of times on the lives, too, it's just like we're, we're fighting it. But usually those are um, assessing what's there. It depends on the product that you're doing. They have smoke and smoke less. Um, usually it's like uh, matching signage to what the register scans them as. There's usually like a promotional price or something like that. And so you're just assessing, making sure that things match up, line up, um, any uh, signs that need to be placed. Uh, they'll give you specific instructions on how to do that, do some inventory of the product that's there. Um, and yeah, that's a lot of you know pharmacies and gas stations and stuff like that. Fish dropped three Mate. free jobs yesterday. Did you get paid for them yet? Yeah. Wait for Costco demo audits to go live. Then going to do some of those today. Us too. Us too. Is restocking for a store weird? No weirder than if you worked for the store. But by and large, it's pretty simple stuff. You know, you just, whether the, whether they bring the product out for you or you go get it yourself, you just go put it. That's why you assess and make sure that everything is to grid and to the planogram before you start restocking so that you don't have to, you know, mess it up and, you know, Put everything on the store on the shelves and then pull it back off. Are you good? Okay. We're headed to the school. So the Costco demo audit is really just to assess, um, you know, the the sample tables. Uh, those are usually promotional uh, time periods where they're only out for a certain amount of the month or the week or something like that. And so you just pop in the store, see if there's somebody at a table that has that sample, yes or no. That's usually all you're doing. Um, if you find it, you know, you just take a picture of it and maybe try it, but you know, um, if it's not there, you just take a picture of like the general aisle to show that that promotion's not out. Yeah. We're going to go. All right. I have to pee if you're going to do that. Okay. So uh, this off. uh, yeah. All right, guys, I got to go take care of some children things at the school and it's not my children who are the issue. So thank you. Watch the videos, download the apps, write down your questions. Please, guys, if my content comes up on the For You page, like, share, repost, do all the things. I'm having a lot of trouble with TikTok. Um, I would really, really appreciate it. I'm having a rough time right now, so please do that for me. Um, and uh, my daughter, Faith, will be doing a shop live tonight. If you're not interested in that, that's okay. Um, I will try to get on some other time today. I love you guys, and have a great rest of your day. Bye.